Morning, folks. Today I'd like to talk about cardio hacks. How to make cardio, cardio a little more tolerable. First thing, you get the ball rolling. Have one coffee. That'll get the blood pumping. And then start cardio. Should take almost 20 minutes from, from wakefulness to the cardio. Therefore, there's no, no excuses. Uh, another thing I like to do is set out my clothes, my running clothes or my gym clothes. Um, as soon as I wake up, I step into them. I call it uh, getting to costume. Once I get uh, into that mode and that mindset, I got the right gear. It's off to the races and start in cardio in the morning. Another trick is to do intervals. You can go one for one, one slow, one fast, two slow, one fast, or just mix it up. Mix it up, keep it fresh. Uh, yeah. Another thing I like to do is I like to watch YouTube vids on my cardio. I have a recumbent bike in the basement. I you know, take my tablet and I watch uh, Machiavelli Motivation, Shred Honk, just bodybuilding videos that I'm into. And you just zone out. Um, yeah, and get the work in. Or if you're a cardio nerd, maybe you'll read a book. Not so much, maybe. Maybe just a magazine. Another thing is, it doesn't have to be an all-in-one rep or set. Um, you can do 10 minutes of cardio here, 10 minutes of cardio there. As long as it adds to about 45, 45 to an hour, um, yeah, it all adds up. You can also change equipment. Uh, do 10 minutes on the elliptical, 10 minutes on the bike, uh, 10 minutes jogging outside. Yeah, it's, it's August... Uh, August 2nd and winter's coming. So get that cardio in that side. Another benefit or hack is how it will make you feel. You feel a lot more energized, uh, ready to conquer the day. And uh, start in the morning, it'll set your set uh, set you know set your day up for success. One more thing that I do personally, audiobooks. I have earbuds, and I just listen to audiobooks while I'm doing my cardio. I just uh, go to uh, a good, good, good headspace. Another option for cardio is doing um, YouTube vid, uh, body weight or calisthenics, uh, cardio, and uh, it's really interactive and it's a good way to put in the time. Like uh, it's high intensity, and uh, yeah, it works the whole body. In the past, I've done some uh, body, uh, beach body, beach body programs. So I'll leave a link below. Uh, check it out. It's a good way to get cardio in at home. I don't know if anybody's suffering with COVID, but this is a chance to get uh, your home workout on. Another way to get motivated or energy is pre-workout supplements. So check uh, bodybuilding.com or Amazon. And uh, just get the one that uh, that you, that you uh, think would benefit the best from. And if you're doing weights along with cardio, I suggest weight or cardio in the morning, weights mid afternoon, uh, maybe cardio again, or or start with uh, weights in the morning and then do cardio right after. You can switch it up sometimes. Just change it. Uh, Keep the, keep the muscles guessing. Another thing that'll make it fun is doing cardio with a friend. Maybe you walk together, maybe you jog together, maybe you run together. But uh, if you're doing it with another person, it uh, it helps. It's the, the peer pressure, the accountability, um, and the camaraderie shit. The main thing is to find what you like. It... Uh, Makes it more bearable, makes it fun, makes it something you want to do, and uh, yeah. So that's that's pretty much it. I challenge you to start cardio right after this, and get that ball rolling, get the momentum going, and uh, this is some cardio hacks by Ryan Dalton. Uh, please like and subscribe.